in ratio and proportion if it is given uh, a is to b b is to c and c is to d how to find out a is to d or finding a is to b is to c is to d let us uh, let me explain this technique here for example uh, take the question a is to b is equals to 2 is to 3 and b is to c is given 4 is to 5 and I'll say C is to D, third one. Okay, this is the 1 is to 3. Any ratio is given to do this A is to D or A is to B is to C is to D, four together. First, you need to find out same like a previous trick A is to B is to C value. That means first 2 is to 3, next to B, C is 4 is to 5. Okay, up to here you can do as it is. So that means we will uh, multiply this. So 2 into 4 is 8 is to again 3 into 4. 3 4 is 12 is to again 3 into 5 is 15. Okay, this is uh, up to here is A is to B is to C. We did previous trick. Now, last one is C is to D, right? So that is must be under C. That is a uh, 1 is to 3. So, to find out A is to B is to C is to D value, we will multiply uh, 3 times. This means uh, with A to C, again B to C, again C to C. First, we will multiply this. A to 1. A into 1 is, mm, that is 8. 8 into 1, 8. Again, 12 into 1. 12 it is. Again, 15 into 1 is 15. So, I wrote here a uh, logic here a into c b into c and c into c next again with this c one more 15 into 3 is 45 so a is to b is to c is to d is 8 is to 12 is to 15 is to 45 instead of taking let like, 2x 3x or making the b co b uh, ratio same or c ratio same we can apply uh, this rule so this concept let me explain with one example okay so here is the question Ratio between the salary of A and B is 3 is to 5. So what we should do directly right? 3 is to 5 is A is to B. Again B and C is 4 is to 5. So under B, 4 is to 5. C and D, 6 is to 7. Okay, this will let us will take later. First we will take this 3, 5, 4, 5. So the method is 3, 4, 0, 12. Again 5 into 4 is 20. 5 into 5 is uh, 25. Immediately what you should take? C is to D is 6 is to 7. So 6 is to 7 you write. And then with 12 into 6, 20 into 6, 25 into 6. So 12 into 6, 72. Right? Is to 20 into 6. So 120. 25 into 6 is 150. Again the last one 25 into 7. 7 5 35 3 1 75. So 175. This is the A is to B is to C is to D. Find the salary of D if A is getting 7200. So you should take only A and D. So okay, the method is directly A by D is equals to 72 by 175 because a value is 72 ratio d is 175 a is given 7200 just to take 7200 by d is equals to 72 by 175 we can cancelling or do cross multiplication so d is equals to 7200 into 175 by 72 just simplify that is the salary of the d 72 times 100, 17500, 0, 0. 1700, uh, 17500. Okay, the, this is the trick. The main thing is you need to apply this uh, trick. So just remember this is the table. It's easy. Not only A, B, B, C, C, D. If you add one more also, same. We can take here D is to E. So that technique you can apply in this.